hello it's wet flows again all right where i drop for you wet flows of knowledge and today what i'm going to be sharing with you is how to mm -hmm. <laughs> stop how to add a clickable link to your canva book you know whether your workbook or your cook guide a cookbook whatever book you have made your summary guide how to add a clickable link you know a lot of persons who finish and at the end of the day they're not able to uh, 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 add clickable links on the table of content which has actually been a very big issue so today I'm just gonna solve this puzzle for you all right it's tiny it's minute all right so what you're just going to do is pay attention just watch the video do exactly what I have done and after this I'm just gonna give you another tip Another wonderful tip on Canva. So here, I just want to make sure you succeed in your book publishing business and have things very easy for you. So let's move into action. Okay, here now we have um, we have our table of contents. Just make sure you have your table of contents, and then make sure you know exactly where your pages are: the chapter one, the chapter two. Okay. The chapter 3 to the end all right you exactly know the areas you want to add a clickable link to all right so right now beginning with this let's make it fast chapter one all right click just hit on it when you hit on it don't highlight just hit on it and then right click when you right click click link then look for where your chapter one is for me is page four i hit on page four all right then i say done look here it shows the link added so i say done so here i hit my chapter two click right click link then coming down to this place is in page six link added then done all right then my page chapter three okay for uh correction sake not to make mistake where is chapter three my chapter three is in page seven okay so let's go right click then go to page seven look for it voila added right uh something went wrong here my chapter chapter four chapter four went off let me see chapter four is project time timeline so hold on i will have to add my chapter four okay so let me add my chapter four, chapter four. It says uh, projects, project timeline. All right. It's remember it will have a link from the one I copied it from. So it's a late in it. So chapter four. Chapter four. Like I have made a mistake, really. So please just hold on. Let me correct this mistake. Okay, so uh, I'll pause this video, then we'll get back to you. Okay, great. So chapter one, let's take come back, click on it, and then link, which is four, page four page four okay then chapter two see i have a lot to show to you chapter two is page six all right page six and chapter three which is about us let's be sure about us about us is page seven 
three is page seven. Right click. Page seven. Chapter four. We go on page eight. Page eight, then you have chapter five. Chapter five, which will go on page nine. Search for page nine. Click on it and add. Now, this contact us is the final page. So let's link it to the final page. All right. Final page. Now page, which is this. Let's go down to chapter 10 or page 10. All right, so now it is done. This is where you'll be having some issues after linking your page. I guess you've seen how to link it. So now click on your share to download it. You click download. You know, normally, as publishers, we have to download by uh, print, PDF print. This is what I want to show to you so that you get exactly what I want to do. You download as PDF print, right? For your, you know, publishing on Amazon and stuff like that. But there's something you just have to know. It would not be good if I double into this and not give you exactly what you need to succeed in this, okay? So if I just give you half big information, it will not really work out, okay? So this is the reason why I just want to give you something unique, cover all knowledge area. Don't forget it's wet flows, where you have wet flows of knowledge coming to you, okay? Free of charge, all right? So, uh, our uh, 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 download is done okay so we just have to just wait a little while for it to be completely set so done now i click it open remember it was downloaded on pdf print just exactly what you would do if you're actually downloading your uh, a book for publishing on amazon kindle All right so now let's look at the work we've done so far this is one see our chapter one hold on let's look at what we did let's look at what we did there i downloaded the first one sorry i downloaded the first one on a standard so let's make this pdf print let's make the pdf print so why that is downloaded you see chapter one is done chapter two can you can you see can you see can you see let's put this on here can you see chapter three wow you have a clickable link now so you won't have issues publishing your book and wondering how will people click on this when you publish them chapter four see it all right you can see it then let's move up again chapter four chapter four where is the table of content where are you table okay fine chapter four you have chapter five can you see chapter five and then you have the final page contact us voila whoops this is awesome guys this is awesome right so let's look at the one we just downloaded on uh, using pdf prints and see what happens to it okay so both standard and pdf prints we've just gotten into so as you can see the both of them 
are working very well so it's either you use pdf print or you use your pdf standard but remember as an amazon publisher you are actually making use of prints pdf print and not pdf standard so i want to say a very big congratulations to you now you have this knowledge what are you going to do go ahead do your book on canva very clean the same way you add table of content and add clicks on it uh, on uh, dog, Google Docs, that exact thing you do with this very one. So you have everything inside Canva, all right? So let's assume you want to remove the links. All you need to do is right click. When you right click on, on any particular one, you still click on this place, you click on remove. And when you do, do that, can you see there's nothing here again, all right? How, do you, how are you able to show your link is clickable? See, when you come to this very one that has, you've already linked, see, you click on it. When you click on it, these things will appear. So what you're going to do is this one is to link. Why this one is to go to the page, chapter two. From Canva, you can even go there to be sure it's working very well. Can you see? Voila. All right, that's chapter two. So guys, share this video, comment. I want you to say something comment something in the comment section so that is a boost for me to give you more videos like this more tips tricks more tips all right that will enable your publishing business on amazon do not forget this is workflow share this video comment like subscribe all right subscribe and hit the bell button so that when i publish the next video coming very soon it will be something wonderful that will help you in your publishing business especially on canva then you are going to be successful. God bless you and thank you very much. Hello, bye.